Welcome to Australian Earth Science Education. In this experiment, we are going to model the process of open pit mining with progressive rehabilitation. To make your mine, you will need a pan, some ore, I'm using decorative marbles, soil, sand, some small plants, a spoon, and gloves. Microbes in soil may cause disease, so wear gloves for the experiment and thoroughly wash your hands afterwards. Before mining, companies consult with landholders, traditional owners, and local government to determine whether there are any important sites that must be protected. These groups also help the company to plan for land use after mining. The mining process begins by clearing the land. The topsoil is collected and stored for use during rehabilitation. Native seeds may also be collected and grown for revegetation. During mining, companies undertake progressive rehabilitation if possible. The land is contoured into gentle slopes, and the saved topsoil is replaced and planted with appropriate seeds. After mining, the remaining areas are capped with topsoil and revegetation continues. The land may be used for pasture, recreation, or habitat. The result of rehabilitation is monitored to ensure that the desired plants are growing and that there's no contaminated drainage. If problems occur, they must be fixed before the land is returned to the council or other owners. Make your own mine site using the materials you have gathered. First, put a layer of sand in the pan. This represents the bedrock in the area. Place your ore on top of the sand and then cover with soil. Plant some of your little plants or grow grass on the site if you have time. We are going to mine this site with progressive rehabilitation. This method is often used in New South Wales coal mines. Your spoon is your mining equipment and must be used for all excavation. Clear areas for mining and reserve the topsoil off to the side. Collect your ore for processing at another spot. When you have finished mining part of the pan, rehabilitate it by covering the sand with reserved topsoil. Work your way through the mine site. You will notice that the level of the soil is not as high as it was before mining because so much material has been removed. We will leave a void in this mine site that can later become a lake after mining. After mining, evaluate your efforts. Did you extract all of the ore? You can sift through the tray with your fingers to see if you succeeded. Is your final landform stable? Steep benches in mines are not final landforms and they may have landslides as shown in this photo. What could your land be used for after mining? Would it be good for grazing or as a recreational area? It is important to clean up responsibly. Dispose of soil and sand in the garden, not down the sink. Rinse your ore and equipment outside. Wash your hands thoroughly after cleaning your equipment. 